What's up guys, 7 here and I've got a quick video to show you um, how to use the uh, the Bungie website to do some really cool things if you're playing Destiny. So uh, I'll have another video that goes over the mobile app, but this is going to be specifically about the, uh, the website first. So you can see here just some cool things. There's a banner hanging in the back, that's for Dead Orbit. I think that that's there because that's the uh, faction that I have the most rep with. Uh, if you watch some of my other videos, I said that I had the Dead Orbit um, mark on, and I turned into a bunch of bounties, and so I was getting rep with them instead of Vanguard. I didn't know that at the time, but so I think that that's why this uh, banner is shown on the back. Um, this is just kind of cool. It's really just cosmetic. You can kind of like spin your character around and inspect your gear and things that you have, which is uh, a pretty neat little feature. Um, over here, you can see that it can show you your recent game, your crucible score, uh, your KD, both for PvP and for PvE. I don't know that KD uh, matters a lot in PvE. You can see that sometimes it's a uh, couple of the here. But... And then it gives you a breakdown here. Your total number of games, your total number of hours played, healed, but it gives you a breakdown by story, strike, raid, crucible, and your patrol mission. So this is a pretty cool, and you can click on all of these to uh, see how you've done. You can split it up to get your stats specifically. Um, it'll show you all some information about it, and you can, you can click on these to see how you're faring in all of these various uh, game types. Now, another thing that <coughs> excuse me, is really cool about this is, I'm going to go back up here to the top, and you can see your gear rarity. This shows you what you have equipped in all the various slots. But even more cool is that if you click on this, you can actually view all of your gear. So you can see you can see my level gear, my subclass. I can view uh, all of the gear that I have equipped, as well as all of my attributes. I think the light is messed up. Uh, it's showing light level 23. My light is actually level 21, as you can see indicated up here. Um, but uh, that's just uh, I'm not sure why that's happening. But what's really cool is you can actually view this how I expect it to be. So for example, if you look at this, you can see what the, uh, the various ways that I customize the weapon is. And they should do that with the subclass. I want to put my shotgun on because the next thing I'm going to do is play the crucible and I love me some shotgun in the crucible. I'm going to go ahead and click on inspect and I can choose to quit and that will put that item on so the next time I log into the game it will actually be on my character. So that is just um, really cool. You can also um, see I got to adjust my uh, camera angle over here just a second. Um, but you can actually, there we go, that was a little rough. You can see what is stored in your bank too. So you can see I've got my rifle I stored the bank from the very beginning just because um, I don't know I kind of thought it was cool it's like a old type of weapon um, but it's actually modern in our sense but you can see all of the various items that I have stored uh, even in my bank and so that's uh, definitely a cool feature as well. Alright I'm going to move the camera back over here and um, we can also view the uh, inventory see what things I have let's see what bounties I have active you can see how much uh, glimmer I have and uh, my marks and everything so it's pretty cool you can see this for yourself or if you want to uh, search other players. Probably my favorite feature. I do this on the mobile app all the time, specifically about bounties. I made a, a video showing off where I um, had a level really quickly, and I talked specifically about wanting to get those bounties done. Well, here you can see what bounties you currently have active, um, but you can also click right where you see it says currently click down here for available, and you can see what bounties the vendor has available, and you can go and pick those up. So if you see bounties that you're like, oh, I really need to go pick those up before I do this mission, go back to the tower and see. Um, pick That's one of my favorite features when you're just on the go. Rather than having to wait for the load times, which are a little long in this game, you know, to go back to the tower and pick up a bounty, just check from the mobile app or your computer to see if there's bounties that you want, and then, if so, go back and pick them up. Another cool thing in this uh, shows your reset. So you can see that this says level 26 raid. I'm nowhere near there. I'm on level 21 right now. But this shows you when your weekly and when your daily uh, are going to reset based on the number of hours and also what they are. So if you want to see what the daily is, you can log into the mobile app or on the computer and see exactly what the uh, daily app is. Excuse me, I said mobile app. You can see exactly what the uh, daily story mission is on the other side. Here you can see uh, some kills and your closest bonuses after you get a certain number of kills. Um, and then you get uh, like glimmer bonuses when uh, killing the enemies and you have consumables. And so this shows you sort of how close you are to some of those. Up here you can see it shows us our marks. Um, Crucible one, I think, is just off the screen here, but you can see the crucible marks as well. So, so far, this is uh, pretty cool. There's some other things that uh, I'm going to show you real quick, but this is everything pertaining to your specific guardian. Um, there's a lot of features on this website, including like groups and clans and uh, sort of all of like the history and the story, uh, but I'm not going to get into any of that. I'm just going to show you some of like, the, the features that I think are like, the most crucial to Destiny gameplay. Um, this being one of the second game, the tower vendor. So, you can actually view a 
a map of the tower. I think some of it might be cut off by stuff on camera here, but you can actually see, uh, so you can see that I have mail waiting for me, um, so that's kind of cool. When I log back in, um, I have some mail in the mailbox for me, but what's really cool is you can actually click on uh, these, this interactive map, and you can see what they have available. So this is great if you um, like are wanting to, well, these aren't running there. Uh, it says it's air. Let me try to see. This wasn't happening just a minute ago, but let's try the Vanguard to see. Um, well, that's, that's odd. A minute ago, it was showing me the uh, attributes. I'm not sure why it isn't now, but um, maybe it's uh, maybe there's some server issues or something. It's still a uh, new game, but um, you should be able to see all the attributes um, for the gear so you can kind of plan uh, what gear. You can also see when the stock refreshes. So that's helpful also when doing bounties. If you look at the bounty tracker, you can see when new bounties will be available. That's something that like is really helpful. You know, again, I talked about bounties before, but this is how you can see what bounties are going to be available, and if you can go back and pick them up, and also when the bounties are going to reset. So it's a very helpful feature. So I definitely recommend picking up the mobile app or at least signing in on the Bungie website. I'll have a link in the description where you can do that. And make sure you have your accounts linked, so that way you can do the cool things like equip weapons and everything. But there you guys have it. That's a quick rundown of the Bungie website. I hope that that was helpful. Uh, be sure to stay uh, tuned and subscribe to my channel because I'm going to have a lot of Destiny content coming out tonight. I'm so excited about this game. I'm just making videos all the rest of this night. So be sure to subscribe so you can uh, get all that content first. Thank you so much for watching.